was that a little, a little early for you? Uh, you know, I, I lead by example. Okay. What's the part? Me, talking wise, not yet, but hopefully one of these days. And just kind of talk about prepping for Navy. It's, it's your first chance at them. I mean, you were. I don't know if you were you at the were you in the Meadowlands last year? Uh, no, go? I wasn't. I okay. wasn't able to go, but. Uh, we prep for them like any other team, you know. They run this triple option, you know, it's a hard offense to uh, get by. So, but we come to work every day, practice hard, you know. We're just ready to come out and uh, hopefully get this victory. Where'd you, where'd you watch the game last year? Uh, where did I watch it last year? Oh, over uh, Cal Rudolph's house. Okay. Watch the women look at in his family. And what I mean, what did you think as it was unfolding? Uh, you know, they got the upper hand, you know, end up winning. And, you know, now this year I want to just compete and hopefully get this win myself, you know. And what's, I guess, what's the key for a good nose guard play in that game? I mean, what what are you looking for first? Uh, I think I just got to be aggressive because, you know, all the academies that play, you know, they're always aggressive and they strive for perfection. So, you know, I got to work on being perfect myself and just work hard and just you know, do my best. What's the secret of stopping the dive? Tackle it. <laughs> Basically, yeah, that's all I got to do, just tackle the dive. You know, that's my job. Coach Elston was saying that he hoped you took the lessons from Air Force and apply them to this game. What what lessons did you learn from Air Force? Uh, you got to play with good hands and stay low because, you know, that was my first time playing a, an academy team and, you know, it wasn't as easy as everybody thought, you know. People think these academies are, you know, nobodies, but you come to see, you know, they've been competing with the best lately, so. How hard is it not to get caught thinking in that and just react to uh, everything that goes on? You know, it's kind of hard because I'm still young and I'm still learning, so sometimes, you know, I might think before I act. Sometimes I act before I think, and, uh, you know, sometimes I mess up. So, you know, it's hard right now. Hopefully I'll develop and get everything right sooner or later. Is it when you play one of these option academy type teams? Is there any way to know what it's going to be like until you start playing against it? Uh, you just play the technique. We go over and practice, and I think uh, we'll be all right. You know, just uh, do everything coach teaches you, and you'll be good. Was it different though? I mean, like you yeah, really first try to time playing as best it, you can. Yeah, but. we try to simulate it, but it's hard to simulate. You know, a team that you know that's all they do. You know. They run nothing else but the triple option. You know, that's a hard offense to, uh, you know, get by. But it's hard to simulate. At the same time, it's hard to play. But, you know, I'm doing my best. How long did it take you to kind of get used to what Air Force was doing? I mean, was it when you were out there? You know, it was kind of rocky in practice because, uh, you know, Ethan and Captain, all those guys was talking to me like, you know, don't get too frustrated. It's your first time. You know, I'm usually just going to you know, regular power, you know, just get my hands on. But I had to play the cuts now. And, all this type of stuff, but they just kept encouraging me and they keep encouraging me now. You know, I'm kind of used to it now, so I think I'll be better off now. Yeah.